Hello everyone, I hope that you're having a great time. In this video at Learn Tech, we're going to talk about Windows 10 version 21 H2. Before we go forward, I would like to remind you guys, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Microsoft has officially announced the Windows 10 21 H2 and released the first preview to insiders for testing. We're going to review what are the features that are included on this version and when we will be able to install this updated version of Windows. While everyone is excited for the next generation of Windows, with Windows 11, Microsoft stated that they are also focused on supporting the more than 1.3 billion monthly active devices on Windows 10. Windows continues to play an important role in people's lives as they continue to work, learn and have fun in hybrid and remote environments. Microsoft stated that their goal is to provide new features and functionality via a fast and reliable update experience to help keep people and organizations protected and productive. Windows 10 version 21 H2 will have a scoped set of features focused on productivity and security, prioritized to meet the customer needs based on the feedback. The new features are focused on productivity, management and security, which include adding WPA3 H2E standard support for enhanced Wi-Fi security, Windows Hello for business support simplified passwordless deployment models for achieving a deploy to run state within a few minutes. GPU compute support in the Windows subsystem for Linux and Azure Age for Linux on Windows, deployments for machine learning and other compute intensive workloads. Given the continuation of increased PC engagement for remote and hybrid play, learning and work, Windows 10 will be delivered using servicing technology, which means like the normally monthly update process. So in order to get Windows 21 H2 version, you will need to update your PC with the latest updates and once you have Windows 21 H2 there, you can just download it and install it. This Windows 10 release is targeted for the second half of 2021 and Home and Pro editions for, of version 21 H2 will receive 18 months of servicing and Enterprise and Education editions will have 30 months of servicing and in addition, Microsoft will launch the next version of Windows 10 long-term servicing channel based on version 21H2 at the same time and it will have five years of servicing as it has been announced in February. So what are the next steps? The launch of version 21H2 continues to fully leverage the Windows Insider program to obtain user feedback and data insights on quality. Microsoft have released already 21H2 version to Windows insiders who were moved to the release preview channel from the beta channel because their specific devices did not meet the hardware requirements for Windows 11. This enables them to instead experience the latest innovation and enhancements in Windows 10. So basically, if you want to test it right now, you just have to be member of Windows Insider program and then you can test this version of Windows 10. In order to install this new version of Windows 10, open your Windows update settings and select check for updates. If the update appears, you can simply select download and install to get started. But normally, according to Microsoft, we'll be able to install the official version of by beginning of September or October. So Basically, we just have to wait till then and we should keep installing these updates that have been released recently from Microsoft. So basically, that's all that I wanted to show to you guys. Let's hope that these new features that are, will be included on Windows 10 21 H2 version will be very useful for us and hopefully our Windows experience will be better. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Wish you all the best. Thank you.